give me yeah. something to make. I'm trying to think of what assets you. What, I have uh, TF2 and Siege, and maybe Half Life. Have you downloaded Petra's model? I'm I'm not doing an SFW. <laughs> I have said this. They, they have they have clean versions. I'm not using Petrus's models. I'm using yeah, what I, mean, I have. If you look at my if, okay, you, if you look at my I am my, not uh, looking at your speed. You, you look at you look at my stream. You know these aren't default. These are improved. Okay, you can have there's default. You can I, do that. I, I just give me something I can use with what I have. Um, you need to recreate the um, Tachanka, not the Tachanka, the fuse and the hostage meme. Here's the th um. <sighs> Some pretty pretentious shit right there. Okay, who can I use as the hostage? Um, Here, actually, here's a better question: Do I actually have fuse as gadget in the hockey pucks? Well, you don't need it because this is the one where he does the um, the body slam, like he's doing the fucking. Just hot rope, fucking elbow drop on top of the. So the you're saying I just need to have him do a wrestle elbow down fall onto the onto a hostage? You know what? <laughs> okay, I'll work. Uh, I need a t I need a map. Your girlfriend is loud. Like, no offense. She's like five feet from me, my dude. Oh, that's why. <laughs> Wait. Why is she always on the phone whenever you're in chat? She's in Discord 24 7, bro. Oh, okay. Well, it happens. I'm not. I actually go out and, you know, buy drugs. So at least I do more drugs. <laughs> Don't say that! <laughs> <laughs> this is all be This is. No! Bad! Bad shock! <laughs> I like how this just. It's just spawned in like this. This is just dumb looking. <laughs> it's to chunk out. Must stop. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, hold on. That much might be able to do something here. <clears throat> so, what if I make this dragon, right? Oh, yeah. Ejaculate flames. <laughs> why is I why am I recording this while in a chat with you people? <laughs> this will get you more views. No. <laughs> make sure you do the make sure you do the Kraken subtitle thing where you put our subtitles at the bottom of the screen if it's every single word we say. So you gotta spend a lot of time in post editor. Well, I gotta upload this tomorrow though. You gotta upload this whenever you're done doing the stupid captions. <laughs> so you want me? Okay, what colors do you fucking want? Uh, I want pink. Give me pink. You want pink? Okay, Kaito. I want pink. What colors do you want? Um, uh, give me green. Give me green. Okay, fine. And I'll just. Fuck, I get- I don't fucking know. <laughs> Since I'm the one here that has the most questionable sexuality, you just make my pink. <laughs> <God damn it. laughs> this is- this is stupid. Okay, if this- okay, hold on. Okay, fucking- Alright, so I'm gonna place the scout- I have Chunk and Scout place for the moment. What angle should I be going? This like, scout's like cowering on the ground, it's like looking up at Chachanka? Or how should I do this? Um, uh, he, he, he doesn't see it coming. He doesn't know. He's just running away. He's running... Okay, so... I guess an easier free thing for me to do is I couldn't put the running animation on Scout for a moment and just freeze frame it. Like, right? <laughs> that, might be, that might be easier. But yeah, here, here's what a rain meter is. Shot. Rain? I hate rain meter. Uh, what? Get out. We're talking about the app, the, the application for Aimir, right? Yes. The thing that like turns your thing into like a moving screen, pretty much. That's actually pretty cool. That's not what you do. Like, I, I've done some pretty interesting things. Oh, I saw what's his name um, from Warframe in there. I saw him. Hold on. Uh, Where's he at? There he is. Oh, yeah. There's Warframe. Found it. All right, uh, Shock. How's this angle look? This look good for an angle. Oh, that's like that. Um, I would say go a little closer to the scout and look up more. Like go. That? No, like go down to his legs. 
Like, put your camera where his, like, knee would be and back up a little bit more. It's going to be a little bit closer. Like, just get, like, just aim at his knee and go towards it, his uh, right knee. Right. Yep. Right. Um, up a little bit. I'd say lower your, um, or zoom in a little bit. Like, keep the camera where it is, but just zoom in. How do I do that again? Uh, scroll wheel while you're holding on to the uh, camera. Okay, zoom in. Okay, right there. Right there. All right. So just kind of focus on this a little bit. I gotta turn the scout a little yep. bit, and I got. I need to make his face like worried right now before I do anything, because once I add the rig to this thing, it's gonna be stupid. <laughs> and you know it is. Like rigs are kind of dumb when it comes to. Hold on. Why is this? Oh, is that his eyes? That is that is that his eye? I'm learning. I'm learning. I know where the eyes go now. Oh, no, what I was what I was gonna do with? I just need the scout in general. Fuck. Oh my god! Somebody sent me a message this morning saying that the thing about my work that makes them the hardest is my upload schedule. I don't know what that's supposed to mean, and I feel scared. That, no, that that means like I. They said that it's because I'm constantly uploading stuff. Like there's always new stuff. It never gets stale. Like that's the thing that gets them aroused the most is how frequently I upload. Why am I listening to this? All right, so we're out in. Okay, so I need to look oh. more. Oh, Remember, it's all about looking as natural as possible. So just kind of put yourself in his shoes and try to like because when i when i make poses and whatnot sometimes i'll actually like like facial poses and i'll do it myself to try to mm. get an idea of what it looks like <laughs> just the mm. <laughs> there you go. There you go. You, you, oh nope right. oh here there we go that looks good <laughs> but you can't really see it in like the ma you know what i'm having okay here's the thing here's the thing here's the thing um okay so uh for a pose where you can see that face a little bit better uh, grab the legs, bring them, f uh, rotate them forward a little bit. So like, like go on the actual root or the actual leg? No, the, uh, the thigh, the, the part or the thigh, yeah, okay. the hip, that one. Um, so pull it forward a little bit. Like actually pull it forward? Yeah, like rotate it forward. Oh, like ro okay. Leg out. Okay, okay, I got you now. I was about to, <laughs> I was about to do something really bad, so like, this? Yeah, and then slightly make it go to the side like outwards from his body just a little bit okay now do the same thing with the other leg okay okay now grab the spine bone that is closest to the pelvis uh that would be so spine zero okay yeah and yeah, forward would... yeah bring it forward i think he's kind of hunched over a little bit oh uh, whoops i need to I did not grab that line. I grab something. Okay. No, it's actually good if you don't grab the lines because it'll give it a more natural look. Because the body is not always going to be perfectly straight. It's going to be slightly twisted. At some part. like that. Yeah. Now slightly. So which direction? Okay. So he's coming from the right. So I would say slightly angle that joint down and to the right just a little bit. So like this. Yeah, just uh, pull it, make him a little bit more straight, and then just pull it to the to your right, a little bit. No, that's not the right. Yeah. No, that that, that was the right direction. Now just make him make his back straight a little bit. Like that. Yep. And now, kind right. of um, fix the eyes. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Just uh, reposition the eyes, and then with his hands and his shoulders, like. It's, it's kind of going for like a like a, like a tense kind of uh, posture. So make sure that his shoulders are pulled up closer to his head. So okay, so I'm actually going to. So it's the just... collarbone. Yeah, and just pull them up a little bit. With the Not, or like a, no, rotate them. Yeah, global global axis, and then just pull them up like that. The hell is up with this model? Um. Uh, use the use the dark blue line. 
Dark blue line, so okay. Yeah, and then rotate it upwards. Yeah, like that. So bring it right about there. And then do the same for the other one? Yep. But the other way. Yep, and now bring his arms down, his uh, his biceps, those joints down, closer to his body. So um, use the green line. Um, yep, just like that. And all right, I'm I'm learn that's not the right one. There we go. And Let's then now grab, like his, grab his about just... now grab his now grab his forearms. Okay. And then bring them forward towards the front of his body. Right about there, yeah. And twist it to where his hand is pointing downwards. Oh, okay, so like like, what? Yeah, okay, well, yeah, okay. Now, okay, pull it away from his body a little bit. A little bit more. A little bit more. Okay. Okay, now ro now rotate it, going the direction of the thumb inwards, to where his hand is pointing, like the palm of his hand is facing the ground. So grab the, uh, the light blue line and turn it to the left. Yeah. yeah you you're probably got to pull it into his body a little bit more. Um, it's also the direction of... The movement is respective to where you're looking at it from. So, uh, control Z that real quick. And go use it like here. Yeah, go yeah yeah, and then rotate it going like pointing downwards. Like that. Okay. Now do the same exact thing to the other arm. All right. So I'm just gonna. Yep. Like that. Oh yeah. Oh, that I need to pull yep. that up a little bit because. Yep. You'll, you'll hide it, yeah. Okay, and now grab his hands and pull them up to where the palms are facing the camera. Slightly, not like completely facing the camera, but just where you can see the underhand, underside of his hands. There you like, go. Like yep. that. Mm -hmm. Alright, now I can and... work on the face. Oh, wait, hold on. Yep. Okay. Yep. I'm learning. <laughs> I'm learning. Now, what I would recommend is, if you're, if he's coming in from the right, it, it kind of adds to the comedic sense if he's, like, looking off to his right, so the scout's looking to your left, as in he's expecting it to come from that direction, but in reality, it's coming from the wrong direction. It's just basic posture right, combination so that you learn. Turn this way a little bit. Yeah, then turn his eyes to face that way as well. I would say make his turn his head a little bit more towards the camera, and his eyes... Oh, or okay. I, okay, I see what you mean now. So that way yeah. you can that way you can see the expression of his face a little bit better, but you can still see what he's. Oh, looking that's at. perfect. Yeah, like that. that looks perfect. Yeah. I like see? that. And he's, it's kind of got that cartoony TF2 feel. It just reminds me of like a. Yeah. He's reminding me of Shaggy right now. <laughs> All right. And like this on the right looks fine, but if you look on this end, just like, yo. All right. Let's work on that face. Let's work on that face. Um, I would say uh, go into the face because, like, um, what kind of emotion are you trying to like? Fear, scared, nervous, fear, fear. Like, um, I'm going I to would, die. I would say don't drop the jaw at all. Um, okay. Go down to um, lips. Lips H V or uh, lips lips V lips up V. Hmm. <laughs> Yeah, and open it up a little bit to the right. Um, I do need kind of a no, 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 frown. no. Li lips, lips up. Do, do lips up. You, you're on lips B, so it's both of his lips. We want just his top lip to go up. So lip up B. It's it's, a, it's, it's the runner below it. Yeah, like that. Mm. Yeah, and then, uh, yeah, and then find the frown. Who was uh, that? No, that was me making the noise. No, who was who just left the Discord? I didn't know somebody else was in here. Uh, probably Kaito or. Nope, I'm still here. That no, was Fat Much. Nope, Fat Much. Here. Here. <laughs> there's, there's a fifth person in here. That. <laughs> yeah, see, there you go. That, that was just the dimple. <laughs> I think. Um, I think it was White Knight. Oh. oh. He does that a lot. <laughs> there you go. That's perfect. That actually, here, looks pretty actually, good. Um, go to Jaw. It should be the. It should be uh, higher up on the list. Jaw B D. Jaw D. I think. Yeah, I think it's Jaw D. No, that's that's forward. I think B is down. Oh wait, hold on. Is that a... 
uh, hold on. Let me, oh, whoops. Uh, H? Nope, that's left to the right. No, that's sideways. I think that's... V is down. Yeah. V is up and down, I think. No? Oh, this is the H and V model. That's the one that I'm, I'm not used to using this one, so all the things are different. Oh, there we go. There we go. It's Java V. There you go. Yeah. Alright, there we go. Did I fix this? T Actually, his dog tag is probably fine right now. Because it's supposed to be hanging off like that. Because he's hunched yeah, over. Yeah, because he's hanging. Yeah, he is. That's perfect. And then once you get the other guy in the right angle, I'll actually uh, I'll drop some high quality tips for you, mate. Just how to make the whoop. render look really clean. <laughs> He's just right there. Yeah, I, would say, I had them both ready. All right, so okay, so what? Bring him closer <coughs> for sure. Oh, okay, he's gonna be closer. He's just gonna. I'm gonna. I'm thinking like just like the. It was from wrestling. Just like he's gonna be four. Flying through there. Not really flying yep. through the air, but he's gonna be like forward, like right knee aiming for that head. So, oh geez, this is gonna take a good moment because I gotta turn this sideways and then. Boom. Boom. I probably need to go down some more. Like. Why do I feel like somebody's dad teaching them how to shave? <laughs> I don't know, but okay, that angle probably works right here, where he hit. Gosh dang it. There we go, that probably works. Yo, I just got a camera full of dragon cooch. <laughs> That's... You know what? You know what? Instead of just this whole thing, I'm just gonna have the best moments of this. <laughs> I got a face full of dragon cooch. <laughs> yeah. Alright, so I'm going to... Turn his head like... You motherfucker. Just... If I just... Just... You! <laughs> Hold on. I want I want to make a joke thing real quick, just... I, I'll, I'll fix this in a moment, but just... Uh... Need to... You... You have displeased God Tachanka. <laughs> uh, my stupidity as a hat has no end. And just because it's gonna be a simple thing, I'm gonna just, just. Oh jeez. It's so much easier to do the fingers like this. I don't know why, like, with rigs, you just can't do that. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, I know there's a there's actually quick ways to do it, but I don't remember. All right, so I'm just gonna make a sense. I'm just gonna make this into a quick render. Just <laughs> just something stupid like you have displeased Tachanka. I, I need lights. That's why I'm missing. I need lights. Yeah, hold up a second, I'll be there. Um, actually, for, for Tatanka, I have an idea. Um, pull his... Um, okay, grab his, his right leg, his right thigh. Okay, so I need to go back in the motion editor for that. Right, uh, yep. right thigh. And then pull it forward. Mm. Going towards front of his body. Oh, you only, um, like, cross it over? No, no. Um, just bend that knee. Okay, I thought we were going... I thought we were going for like a Dio kind of thing here. Uh, bend it a little bit more. Go like that? Here. Yep, and then grab his foot and point it down towards the ground. So we are going for a Dio thing here. I, that's not what I thought, but okay. And then grab his, grab the shin of his other leg. Shin, so the ankle. Just whatever bone is connected to the fucking shin. Uh, that would be uh, oh, it's the uh, the tibia fibia part, yeah, right there. Yeah. And then angle it, angle it back a little bit, and then point his toe towards the ground. It's all about adding as much character to the uh, pose as possible. That's not the right thing. Did you grab his foot? Yeah. I grab the root. Like that? No, grab the foot, not the toe. Sorry. Okay, sorry, that's my bad. 
All right, so I'm just gonna whoop. hip like that. Turn a little bit. There we go. Um, and now I would say point. Grab his um his bicep. Bicep. Uh, his right. His right bicep. The right one. No, that's the left. Like his perspective right. Okay. Okay. Like sorry. A, now pull it up a little bit, like up in the air. Oh, now that I'm looking at it, it looks so weird. Yeah, no, no, it's, uh, it's cause your the uh the forearm is crooked. Oh yeah, I should probably so, fix that real quick. Yeah, rotate it, just to where it would the elbow goes back into place. Yeah, just by pulling it up. Now bring the uh the shoulder down, the uh the bicep down. Okay, the actual bicep. Okay, sorry. All right, we're gonna bring that down. And then point it to <clears throat> the left, just so it's more pointing towards Scout. Yo. And point it, point it towards his face. So just pull it up a little bit, because if he's addressing somebody, he'd be pointing towards their head or their face. There we go. That kind of works. And lights are easy. You just need three lights. Oh, I know. Oh, it it froze. Okay, geez. All right, let me add. New light. Where's it? Oh god, that is not where I wanted the light. But I will deal with that. It, it spawns on the camera just like a model does. Okay, so okay, I'm, so... I'm gonna pull that back. Okay, nope. I need okay. to. Okay, one thing. Uh, try this first. Um, so click on the light on the in the uh, animations. Okay. Uh, right click on it. Name light. Uh no. Uh. You, there should be okay. It, w it, w it didn't pop up. Uh, yeah. Enable volumetrics. Uh, okay. And then just quickly click on the uh, work camera to get that, and then go to the left off screen. Oh, go so away. drag it over. Oh no! Yeah, like drag it over to the left. Yeah, drag it over. And then turn it. And and then and they, uh, angle it towards them, but make sure the volumetric isn't touching. Okay, so like... So, like, so push it further back. Like, actually move it over. Okay, so... Like, this way? No, 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 I'd say go towards the models, but towards that corner. You see the corner of the room? Okay, so I'm just gonna, I'm like... At. I'm gonna move it this way and just turn it. You're gonna move it that way and then take the green arrow and push it away from you. Like that. And then uh, just... A little bit more? I'd say a little bit more. Okay. And yeah, and then angle it up towards Chonka, but make sure it doesn't actually touch him. Like that? Yeah, okay. Yeah, keep it there, but then just move it and slide it a little bit further back. And... Like that. Okay, and should I turn and... it a bit more? Just so it's like... It looks a little off yeah. right there. I would say just a little bit. You know, maybe I need to intensify it a little uh, Actually, no, you probably don't want to intensify. What kind of what kind of color? I would say change its color before you intensify, so you know what how much you need. Because different colors have different intensities. Uh, okay. Uh, how do I change the color again? Uh, no. Uh, go back. Uh, don't click on that. It's actually in the uh, sliders. What? Oh. It's at the bottom of the sliders. Oh. Uh, you have color let's, red, green, blue. Let's go with a oh. red. Oh, gee. It's reversed. So yeah, if you do that. Yeah, that looks a little uh, too. Ugh. Yeah, so just pull back the uh, the green and blue a little bit. It's like a color mixer, so it depends on how far you slide it. Depends on how much of the color is in there. Oh, that, that that's pretty good. That matches a barn setting. Yeah, I would say so. That's like uh, tannish can, brown. Uh, go up on the sliders and uh, uh, look for horizontal FOV. <coughs> okay, I'm there. Uh, slide it just a little bit to the right. That. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, now the next thing to give it a little bit more—it's already got lighting on the map, so you don't need much character lighting. But I'd say get some rim lights to intensify it. So just uh, right-click on light one. Okay. And then go to copy animation sets. Okay. And then click on the empty space underneath light one and type uh, hit paste animation sets. Oh God! <laughs> and just do it on the opposite yeah, end. Um, 
No, uh, you. the light is coming from the left, so what you're going to do is right click on light 2 and turn off the volume metrics. So disable volume metrics. Alright, and then turn, okay. like, get rid of the color or keep the color? No, keep the color, because it's got to be the same light. And okay. then, uh, once you move the light uh, back, move it towards the camera. Move it towards, yeah. okay. Yeah, uh, but make sure it's on the character, so push it forward a little bit. Alright, and then I need to angle it. Here. Ooh. But move it a little bit to the left, because the light isn't directly in front of them, it's slightly behind them. But your rim lighting would come around because light wraps around objects, so push it forward. Put it more to the left of the scout, like directly to the left, so... Yeah, take, use the red one, pull it to the left, and then okay. push it push it closer to the models, like that. A little bit more, a little bit more. Keep going, keep going. Right there. Oh, I and see what pull, you mean pull. now. Yeah, so it's just enough light that it would actually wrap around the characters, like it would naturally. And one thing you can do is turn down the intensity of it. Oh yeah, that'll probably just help. a little bit. There we go. Yeah. It's subtle, it's subtle stuff like that. Nice. That doesn't look too bad, and if I, we take a look... That's the wrong button. If we take a look in this now, that looks pretty good. Okay. I need to add, the, actually, the render settings and all that stuff. I forgot to do that. Yeah, just 1024, and then... Um, oh, you didn't... Do you have, not have an animation set for camera one? You don't? Okay. Well, we'll worry about that. Uh, did you, uh, so yeah, just set the render settings to 1024. Alright, and... The, oh, okay. Okay, I think I need to. to the... I think I actually need to turn the light up a little bit on light two, just by looking at that. Like the, because like I think, okay, I look... think the volumetrics are on Tachanka's legs a little too much. You might have to just rotate it away. And I think it'll just be fine. Little, little. Or is that going to? I. Wait, hold it's... on. I need to. Oh, I need yeah, to... make sure. Or you can lower the uh, horizontal. There we well. go. That works. That works a little bit. Okay. All right. No, that that's not it. Uh... There we go. Yep, that's better. And then this um, light too. I need to and do. I need to do increasing intensity because if we look at it now, that has had more sh shadows to his scout's face. I mean, you can turn down the shadow filter size as well. How do I do that? It's literally the slider underneath. Oh. Huh. Oh, wait, I need to... Huh. Well, that helped um, a lot. Yeah, here, and also go uh, click the plus icon to add an animation set. And go to new camera. Okay, now go to your camera on your viewport, that where it says camera 1, and switch it to camera 2. So, now click on the arrow, and then go to change scene camera, camera 2. Come on, Discord, you're in. Okay, and now click on the camera in animation set editor. And, and field take, of view? Uh, no, field of view is fine. Uh, focal distance, slide that to the right until that pink square. So bring it a little closer to the scout. So right about a little further, a little further, a little further, right there. And now pull the aperture about a third of the way in. Right, right just right before the A. Okay. And then go to SSAO radius, and then turn that all the way up. Oosh. Okay. And take Blue. tone map scale. Map yeah, Bloom's not, Bloom's not going to show up on any renders or any still images. Oh, okay. Um, tone map scale and just turn down just a little bit. Okay, okay, nope, not like just, just, It's just a tiny. Okay, there? Yep, like that. And then hit the, um, hit the clip editor button to see how it comes out. Not too shabby. And it looks better once it's actually rendered. Yeah. Because it's in full resolution. So but that's basically what I do to get my uh, perspectives and everything. And now I know.